all manner of financial so planning. Is that what you studied at Duke, finance? No. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so you got that basketball. You know, so I, uh, was, you, was you chasing the NBA dream at Duke? I was chasing the NBA dream then. Okay, I, I want to get. Yeah. I want to touch on that a little because we got. I know a lot of guys. Personally, I know guys are chasing the NBA dream and have chased it or right. whatever. So right. I want to touch on that a little bit. So you did play at Duke under Coach K. Yes. Right. What years did you play at Duke? 86, to, 86 to 90. 86 to 90. Okay. Mm -hmm. I was one when he started playing. <laughs> I saw it. So, but I saw his last two years. I thought it was 89. <laughs> Don't go get it twisted. So I, I didn't know he was a high flyer. And he would, he would yam it on you, as they call it. Okay. So. You went to E. Smith, actually. Let's get back to this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. E. Smith. I'm a fan of that product. Let me give you that. Yeah. Full pride. And Coach K came down here and got you. Yep. Yeah. Okay. So, How was that? How that that that, well, that was? You know, it was interesting. Uh, back then, this is like what? This is uh, 86. 80, 86, 86, yeah. So, actually, at the time, my senior year, they, Duke was not recruiting me early. Uh, Wake Forest was. And I really liked Bob Stack. I'm not the Bob Stack. Carl Tasty was mm -hmm. the coach at the time. And I like uh, Wake and I really, in the back of my mind, I was going to go to you Wake. You to go to Wake. Because Duke was not recruiting me at the time. So fast forward, uh, they ended up firing Carl Tacey, brought in a guy named Bob Stack. So I, I take a official visit to Winston-Salem, go with my parents. Had a great visit. We still like Wake. And on the way home, my dad said, what'd you think? I said, I still love Wake. But I said, Bob Stack won't be here very long. <laughs> he said, why you say that? I said, he is a New Yorker yeah. in Winston-Salem. Nah. He said, he's a fast talker. Yeah. I said, what's the same, old money, slow money? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I said, he's not going to fit in. Mm -mm. And sure enough, two years later, he, he was gone. gone. Right. Uh, and so a little bit after that, uh, Duke was recruiting a kid named Stevie Thompson who ended up going to Syracuse. He was good? So, yeah, yeah, had a good career there. Stevie and I are friends. And then uh, he, they needed a, a small forward, so they started recruiting me late. Well, probably around November, December of my senior year. And we took a visit to Duke. Uh, my dad, of course, my dad's former military, Coach K's former military. So they they got they hit it off right away. Uh, I like the fact. Was that, it a good program then? Yeah, matter of fact, that was. Uh, it's after Johnny Dawkins, right? Yeah, that was Johnny Dawkins' senior year. Senior was my senior okay. year. Hey, Fred. So yeah, yeah. So we got some historians. Yeah, yeah, Fred. No, no, Fred. I was watching. I see you. Trust me. Uh, and uh, they lost to Louisville, uh, never nervous Purvis in 1986 mm -hmm. in the national championship. That was my senior year in high school. So, but that year I took several trips to Durham. I would take my boys. We go up watch Duke play, and uh, I liked several things about it. Uh, one, it was close to home. I wanted my parents to have an opportunity to see me play, and I think in four years, we may have played 120 games. Wow! They got to maybe <laughs> 95 of those 120. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. Wow. it was in the building. Yeah. yeah. So, yeah. Matter of fact, one game we we're warming up, and they just this is this is before. Duke really blew up. They used to sit beside the bench. They sat beside us on, on the, the bench. bench. And so one game, we looking up my parents out there. And they, Billy Cage said, hey, where you folks? He said, we can't, we can't start playing until they get here. <laughs> so, I mean, so that was different time, different age. But, uh, so, you know, I had a great experience at, at Duke. And, uh, you know, we won a few games and, uh, you know, had built some great relationships. And it was I was uh, playing for Coach K. It was you great. He just retired, the legend. Yeah, yeah. Uh, it was it was great. Uh I guess what I learned was I, I learned how to manage my affairs. Now, I know people are like, well, you play basketball. Yeah, but, you know, basketball goes away at some point. We, we talked about that mm -hmm. prior to the show. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, but uh, I learned how to manage my affairs. So talked about I learned how to prepare. Mm 